started that you don't need supplements to see results in your fitness journey. I mean, I personally, I don't use all of these products every single day. I try to get all of my nutrients from real food and then I will go to my supplements as kind of a last resort. If I need to hit a certain macro and I haven't gotten there, maybe I'll opt for my protein powder or one of my other products. So yeah, so I just wanted to put that out there. You don't need them, but they can be helpful. So let's the first product that I'm going to be using in my day, if I choose to use it, is Shakeology. This has been pretty hyped up over Instagram, and basically it's just a meal replacement shake. Um, it has a shit ton of um, superfoods in it, so it's pretty good. It has certified low glycemic index, so for the diabetics out there, you can have this. It's pretty good for you. Um, yeah, so, and it also, it lists all the superfoods that are in it on the back here. So, I got the flavor strawberry, which I heard is the best. Um, the macros on this are 140 calories per serving, uh, 2 grams of fat, 14 grams of carbs, and 17 grams of protein. So, overall, pretty good. Um, I like to drink it in the morning just to kind of get me going. It claims to, um, provide healthy energy, which I've definitely noticed an increase of in myself. I mean, I'm not, it doesn't make me like jittery or anything, but I just feel like good, you know, ready for the day. So I really do like drinking this in the morning. All right. So the next product that we're going to go into is the stuff that I take before my workout. So the first product that I take before my workout is pre-workout. Um, I try to cycle, you know, 30 days using it, 30 days off so that my tolerance doesn't get too high. But the current pre-workout that I'm using is Beachbody Performance Energize in the Flavor Lemon. Hopefully that'll focus. There we go. Yeah. So something about, you know, pre-workout and protein powder and all that stuff is I am so picky, sorry, about the flavors. And I always thought that like pre-workout and protein powder, like it, to me it just tastes disgusting because you know, you get those shaker cups, shake it up, and then are you ever drinking it? And you're like, okay, this isn't too bad. And then you get like a clump of powder. And I'm sorry, but that's just disgusting. So I, and I've also had pre-workouts in the past where I'm just like, oh, this is really sour or just, eh. So anyway, so when I got this in lemon, I was like, you know what? Maybe, maybe, just maybe it'll be like lemonade. And I'm going to show you the guys the color of it. It was kind of surprising at first, but it is like, I, I don't even know if you can see it right on the camera, but it is like a neon yellowy green in person. I don't know if the color will show that well on camera, but yeah. So I went into this a little bit skeptical and to be completely honest, it literally tasted just like lemonade and I was so excited. And the powder itself is such a fine consistency that when you shake it up, it is literally, like, I don't even think about it when I'm drinking it. I'm like, ooh, lemonade, yeah. And, which is awesome. I, I don't get those clumps in it. I don't feel like I'm drinking pre-workout. And I get a great amount of energy from this. I feel really focused during my workouts. I definitely, definitely recommend this. So the next product that I take with my pre-workout, um, kind of like mix of stuff, is glutamine. I usually take two um, capsules of this. It does come in pill, uh, sorry, in powder form, but I got the pill version. So I'll just take like two of those with my pre-workout. Basically, glutamine is an amino acid that's already in you and it just gets a bit depleted while you're working out. So I've realized, well, I've not realized, but like I've noticed that if I take this before my workout, I feel like my endurance is good. It stays, you know, it's, it stays high for a long time and I just feel really, really good. So, this is my little pre-workout stack right here. All right, so next we're gonna move into what I take after my workouts. So the protein powder that I've been using is this Beach Beach Body Performance Recover Post Workout in the flavor of chocolate. This is basically just protein powder. Um, it is of a whey concentrate. The macros on this are 130 calories, um, one gram of fat, 10 grams of uh, carbs, and 20 grams of protein. So overall, pretty balanced. Um, once again. Consistency is so, so good. You're not gonna get those clumps. Um, and I don't even know if you guys know what I'm talking about when I say that, but like, if you've experienced it, like, you know, it is so nasty. But I just mix this with milk, especially soy milk is like my favorite. Honestly, I'm not even vegan or anything. I just like the taste of soy milk better than regular milk. So mix that together, chocolate milk. So then the next thing that I use after my workout is this creatine from BPI. Um, I love this. I mean, a lot of different people 
have very controversial opinions on creatine, but I personally take it, um, just a little scoop, like, every day. I think it's, like, three to five milligrams or something like that. And, yeah. Honestly, I think it's helped a lot with my muscle growth and everything, so I will just mix that in with my protein shake and boom, gains. So, that is what I take after my, uh, workout. So now we're going to move into just like the other kind of random vitamins and stuff like that that I use. To be completely honest, I don't even really use that many like vitamins or anything. The only two things that I use are this like Nature's Bounty Hair Skin Nail Gummies. It has biotin in it. Um, I take these occasionally. Helps with my hair growth and that kind of stuff. And then the other thing that I use is fish oil. You can basically find these two things anywhere. I'm pretty sure you can even get this on Amazon. So that's about it. Alright, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, I am going to be coming out with a free supplement guide soon, kind of explaining what the purpose of everything is in a PDF format. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment, like, subscribe, all of that stuff, and I will see you guys soon.